Hi, this is Mike Murray, and today I'd like to talk to you about aisle number two in the SEO is not a candy store series. Today we're talking about pricing. It can run the whole gamut of maybe $300 a month to thousands upon thousands of dollars. To understand SEO correctly, you need to understand the pricing possibilities. Are you paying hourly? Are you paying a retainer? Do you have a long-term contract? Do you have no contract? Who's doing the work? What position, what kind of condition is your website in today? How do you rank today for the words you're interested in? Who's going to be working on your website? Do you have people working on it? Is the SEO firm going to be doing the work? Are they going to be making technical changes? Who's writing the content? Who's editing the content? Who's doing the social media? Who's doing the link building? Who's going to work and massage this website over time and to what extent? What are the time frames? What are the considerations? The best way to do SEO is to keep in mind that the pricing has to fit the material. Where is your website at today? What kind of actions are you going to have to take? And then who do you need to hire? What are the best skills that you can afford to pull that off? If you're going to look at SEO, you need to keep pricing in mind. It's not as simple as, well, I'll pay $500 a month and everything will just happen. It's not that simple. Give a little bit more serious thought to SEO before you sign the dotted line on any contract and know what you're getting in for.